Hey YouTube, welcome back to another video. So as always, make sure to subscribe, join the Discord, and Roblox group in the description. Follow me on Twitter, that will also be linked in the description. And if you buy clothing below the group link in the description, you'll get special ranks in the group. So you should do that. And I have a whole bunch of codes for Samurai Simulator, so... As you can see, this is basically just like Unboxing Simulator. Where you have things that you attack, and then once you do that, it either gives you coins or an item, and then in your backpack you have hats that increase your damage and attack speed, literally just like Unboxing Simulator, and pets that increase your walk speed and level, and it has three max for both literally just like unboxing simulator and it has different sized crates and stuff and a premium room at spawn so this is basically just unboxing simulator but yeah i'm gonna show you guys all of the codes for it let's check the game passes they have it where you can equip eight yep it's eight they didn't even change any of the statistics they literally like took on boxing simulator and then changed the guis for it and changed the appearances for everything and they even have the walls that you can buy stuff based on what level you're on so this is literally exactly just unboxing simulator but with katanas so, enough about that, um, it does have a nice amount of players on it, so I'm making this codes video on it, even though it's an unboxing simulator copy, to be honest. Like, it's a good game, kind of, but it just copied unboxing simulator. I'm pretty sure we both know that, but yeah. There's some codes for this game. The first one is Razorfish, and that that one I'm pretty sure it only works for Razor Razorfish gaming. Next code is Woof Woof, all capitals, and that one was a success. So. I'm not sure what it gave me, it said it was a success, I'm pretty sure that was like, four gems, or actually no, I already had that. Oh wow, this game even has quests, literally just like Unboxing Simulator does. So they, they just changed the appearances of everything, it's literally the exact same thing. But, yeah, so... The first code, I'm not really sure what it gave. I'm gonna check. Oh, it gave me a dog. Hat level boost plus one, walk speed boost plus one. I haven't even gotten any hats yet. So, that's not gonna be uh, too useful until I finally get a hat. Oh wow, I got one. Power boost plus four, speed boost 104%. Oh wow, now I do more power. This is literally... Like... I thought they would at least change something. Like, make one of the game passes give maybe 10 or 5 hats instead of... The... 8. But they took and made everything literally exactly the same. Uh... I still do have a lot more codes though, so if you aren't subscribed yet, make sure to subscribe, join the Discord and Roblox group in the description, and the next code I have is free money. This code gave me a thousand coins, so the only difference is I can't even see quests in this game, like... Oh, there it is. So, 
it has more quests, but the quests aren't to buy new items and stuff. So the quests are just a little bit different. So I'm gonna check to see if I can buy a new sword. And... Hopefully, if they want this game to get big, they have to change it and make it original, like... Because it's almost exactly like Unboxing Simulator. So if they made it a little bit different, then that would uh, heavily increase how ga good this game is and this game could actually become really popular if they made it so that you fought mobs and stuff instead of just attacking statues kind of like boxes in unboxing simulator if they made it like that then it would be super original. One thing I do like though is you don't have to press claim for quests, but there isn't a hat level quest. So, if Dungeon Quest made it where, I mean not Dungeon Quest, but uh, Unboxing Simulator. Why did I say Dungeon Quest? Um, if Unboxing Simulator makes it where you can do automatically collecting the quests instead of having to physically manually collect it then that would be better for the game but next one is I want more hats that gave me a level 2 sword pack that gives plus 6 so now when I attack I do a lot more damage and this is basically exactly Unboxing Simulator, except the features that no one likes are changed to be likable. Like the quests, and... Yeah, but I'm not gonna spend my Robux on this game, because I don't have much anyways. And... This game just got advertised, so it... It's not going to last very long unless if they advertise it more or if they make some big changes to it to make it more original. But the next place costs 6000 which is a lot. So that's going to take a very long time to get. But I'm going to go ahead and tell you guys some more codes. So next code is here have a sheet. Since it has the name of an animal in it, it, it didn't give me a pet. That, that doesn't make sense. I like how many hats I have right now, though. Look. Okay. So, next code is Head Bandana. Oh, it gave me a bandana. And the ban bandana is as good as all the other items. So, it only says uncommon or common whenever you click on it. Wait, no, it actually shows the color. I thought it was just green because I had it equipped. So, this game is better in a few ways, but Unboxing Simulator is the original, so it's probably going to do better. Maybe this game might pass it on, like Treasure Quest and Mining Simulator. I mean, why did I say treasure quest? I mean treasure hunt simulator. So, treasure hunt simulator was made first, but the mining simulator was made and had more features, even though it was just, like, the same exact thing. Actually, the Rumble Studios played a part in the treasure quest game. They basically just copy games, like... Treasure Quest Simulator, they uh, did Mining Simulator, and then Dungeon Quest, they did Treasure Quest. So, yeah. Also, Bubblegum Simulator, there's another game called Bubblegum Simulator made, like, six months or a year before it, and then they just made it, but with better graphics. 
but yeah so next code is raining gems and that gave me some gems next code is slash release all capitals success and it gave me some more coins so that's all of the codes i'm gonna save it just in case wait am i spelling that right oh wait i spelled it wrong and yeah i guess that's all of the codes Hope they were helpful. Subscribe, join the Discord and Roblox group in the description. Follow me on Twitter in the description. And quick shout out to all my channel members. If you want to be shouted out at the end of almost every video, just press the join button to the left of the subscribe button. But yeah, shout out to them. And I guess this is the end of the video now. See you all in the next video. Bye YouTube.